Yo, A man, say man, you gaming with spade, man, Bobby, A man. <clears throat> we in the thing for it with a little tutorial, Bobby. It's gonna be a quick one, Bobby. Well, it shouldn't take that long, I'm gonna say that. It's gonna be a little quick one, Bobby. Um, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Comment down below for anything you wanna see here from your boy, spade, man, A man. Um, uh, I can't think of his name, but I do remember somebody coming in and asked me to do some daytime running lights. I, I got you, Bobby. It's easy, man. It's easy. Um, I need to do it on these. Because right now, it look like all them bitches set the head. Like, them bitches shouldn't even be activated like that. Especially not the ones on the corner. The ones on the corner really should be signals, but for this tutorial, I'm going to make those uh, daytime running lights and fix my head, little headlight situation while I'm in now. But man, let's jump into this. Man. Alright, man. So, I have to grab your files or whatever, man. I'm going to grab the e file right here. Pop up in the Z. My little Bobby. And import this goddamn 71 photo. Get this photo in it, big baby. Import. Hopefully y'all doing all right. Hope y'all having a great week, man. Yeah, loud getting through this bitch, baby. All right, get down here to the headlights and shit. Let me see how they is in my hierarchy. You did a test of some separated. Oh. That's gonna be a problem. Need to go separate these bitches first. Alright, um, so. My little side lights, they can be. Oh, damn it, they connected to something back here, too, ain't it? Okay, but. Alright, but, uh, my little side lights right here, I'm finna go detach them things, switch the polygon mode. Give me a second, let me do it real quick. Get that bitch up out of here. I need them to be separated. And we're gonna do the other one. Yeah. All right. Now that I got those separated, uh, we're gonna. Make these two our daytime running lights. And this shit is easy as fuck. So, uh, I'm just gonna do it now. Uh, one thing you wanna make sure you do is highlight it. Go up here to display. Come right here to center local access to object. Make sure X and Y on. I don't know if they got something to do with it, but I just make sure both of them on. Uh, pivot off. And you just wanna click on it one time. Boom. Now they similar. Now if your shit like turn or like upside down or some shit like that, or it ain't it don't look like this, what you wanna do is uh highlight it, make sure your options say keep object, both or whatever, <clears throat> make sure them bitch turned on, click it, let it reset the world, come back up here to center object, click it and it's gonna straighten them up <clears throat> and put them in place. But you want that node to be up there so your lighter emit right. Uh, so now we're gonna highlight it. Well, it's already highlighted. Put the bitch in polygon mode, baby. And let's see what is this set to. Let me see what the what this material is. Okay, so we got two materials. Let's place it too. All right. So you want to make sure your material set the light and missile. <clears throat> Once you set the light and missile, that's it. That's all you gotta do. Cause your external state gonna be zero. Zero it makes a daytime running light. It's gonna when you, your engine cranks up, uh <clears throat> when your engine crank crank up, goddamn your lights come on. Uh those come on and I wanna say when you turn the car and when you turn it off, they go off, whatever. But you gotta make sure the lighter missile is set to lighter missile. 
Uh, so this is lights, LOD, or whatever. <clears throat> I highlight this bit, and I need to select by material. Uh, maybe this is the right one. Nope, gotta find the right one. Hold up, uh, it got to be this one. Yup, and I'm gonna unhighlight this side. Boom, see that's set to two. It shouldn't be set to for one, they probably signals. Uh, I want to say I have to go look at my notes because I can't remember all of them. I'll be trying to, but I can't remember all of them. Uh, let's see if I can find it real quick. So, if we wanted these to be legit signals. <clears throat> For one, we have the name of indicator underscore LF and the other one RF. And you will set those numbers to uh, for the right left side. You're going to set the 5. And then you're going to switch the vertex, set the 5, hit OK. Uh, for the right side, you're going to set the 6. But I'm finna show y'all just with the zero right now, and I gotta go fix the uh, other headlights. So I'll show y'all on that part what I'm talking about with the numbers and the setting and shit. So let me do this real quick. This, I need this to be zero because I want these to be my daytime running lights. They just show you the daytime running light right here. Apply, vertex, and you see how, how the lines coming out like that? Now, some of them, the shit be going all kind of fucking ways. But I ain't really ran into too many problems with it. Uh, apply. And now we need to come over here, switch back to poly mode, go back to my material because I wanted to uh, select the shit for me. And then I'm holding control, making a little box over it, like left click and drag and just unhighlight it. And that's set to one. I want that set to zero too. Apply. Apply. Now we got daytime running lights. Unhighlight like this. Turn it off. Um, and I can really, I can really connect these together. I'm gonna do that. Connect these together, and then I center it. Put it in the center. All right. And I get this uh, DLR. Yeah, I just call it DLR. Uh, well, no, I would call it mm, DTR. L. Daytime running lights. <laughs> and then we just drop the bitch anywhere in the hierarchy. You can put it in a bumper or whatever. Like, if you put it in your bumper, then just know it's going to fall off when your bumper fall off. Uh, all right, so we got the daytime running lights. I'm finna fix my headlights too, and I need to see what this is. I don't know what that is. <clears throat> I'm gonna highlight it, put the thing in polygon mode. Let me see if it'll uh, show me what these are real quick. Highlight, I don't got no. Number on um, it. Let me see some select by material. Come down here to lights, and it brought up all of them. No, wait, no, wait. What are you doing? Why is this a thing? Oh, cause it's on. Oh, mother. No, no. Alright, I like that, I like that, and this is set to 2, so that's coming on with the head like this stuff too, I'm going to set it to 0, I don't need to do that, so these need to be like daytime running lights as well, boom, set that to 0, come over here, set that to 0, boom, there, I'm gonna get it to highlight all that again, select, Okay, unhighlight these. Set it to zero. Oh no, not 20, Bobby. Zero. 
apply vertex zero apply yeah lord and now select this again because it just because this this shit got other shit connected to it so you can't it just need to be the lights by itself make sure you know the name of the material so you can do it like this uh as far as selecting your lights and whatever uh i'm gonna unhighlight these this should be straight uh i'm gonna un let me do this i'm gonna do it like this real quick uh -huh, like that one yeah okay so this straight what i'm gonna do is separate this i want to make these my extra lights so they come on high beams right now they set the one and extra lights it'll be 14. Let's do this one 14. now we did connect it like this but a lot of times it don't work uh they'll stay off the whole time but i didn't got i done got some of them to work with them connected to the headlights so if it don't work for you to get it to work you just need to detach it like how we just did for the daytime running lights you need to detach it and once you detach that motherfucker, uh you should and and rename it rename it to like extra light underscore one or two and if you do if you name it one, it need to be it need to be fourteen. If you name it two, it need to be fifteen. If you name it anything after that, it goes sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Any of those are extra lights. That's how you get your uh your bars at the top, uh the light bars to work properly and shit too. Um so this one, I'm finna try it. I don't know if this shit finna work, but I'm finna try it. Uh fifteen just because, like I said, it's connected to the headlight. So it, this may not work for me. 15. Or only one side will work. I don't know. It'll always be some bullshit. But we did our daytime running lights. And I just wanted to go and fix the headlights on it. Uh, I come back and actually turn my daytime running lights to signals. Because they could be signals on here. Uh, but that's basically all you need to do to get you some daytime running lights. And I showed you how to fix some headlights and stuff for you. Um, let's see. Now I need. Let's see. Yo. Got that bit right now. And those should be right. I'm going to go come back and make these signals. Because they're going to be signals. Uh, yeah. Alright. Let's export that thing. Export that big body. Get that big body out of that big body. Export. Compare and replace. Replace. You don't, you don't see no difference in the, uh, in the open IV. Not, not for real. You don't see no difference. But you see the difference in the game? And that's why I see y'all just say like magic hold on at the snap of the finger all right y'all back in the thing Get to the phone real quick as you can see daytime running lights they ain't coming on with the headlight the headlights ain't even on right now i'm turn it off turn the whole car crank it back up daytime running lights bobby even on the side bobby uh we can turn the headlights on headlights come on now I don't like I said with the high beam being connected to the headlight, they might not work. Uh, and they don't. So I'm a bitch. Hold up. Let me see. It might not be dark enough. Let me debug it. Oh yeah, they don't work. That's cause that's cause like I said they connected to the uh, what you call, but. In this video, I guess I'm going to fix that real quick because it don't take me no time. Uh, if this shit too fast for you, they do got the little option on here to slow it down or whatever. Or you always have the option to watch it as many times as possible to, you know, until you get it. But yeah, I'll, hold on, I'll be right back. Jump in the Z model. Yeah, I'll, back in Z model.
Alright, man. So, in order to get these shits here to work, let's have it all, turn it on. And since I'm finna get them to work, I'm just gonna, uh, I'm not going to, uh, I ain't gonna make them two lights, two separate lights. They finna be one light. Highlight both of them and detach them. Boom. Got that detached. Turn these off. Hide that. Got this one thing right here. And this should need to be called uh, extra light underscore one. Boom. Hit the isolate on it. That shit ain't standard. I'm gonna highlight this bit, display, click on it. Oh, wait, tripping. Click on it, boom. Now that shit is centered. I'm gonna polygon mode it. And I got everything highlighted. We only just need the light shit to be highlighted. So go back over here, get that highlighted. And we're gonna call this 14 my boom. Go to vertex, call that fault team, man. Hit that apply over here, unhighlight it, boom, boom. Go back to structure, L0 already on, and I'm just gonna convert the compound that bit. Cause ain't nothing wrong with that node. And now my daytime running lights. We are going to go and turn those into signals real quick to respectable signals. So I'm going to separate them because they need to be separated to make that happen. Alright, now that they are separated. Uh, uh, turn this one on. Turn that one on. I'm going to highlight it. Cause I need they nodes to be centered to each other. It's loud. Alright, now, for signal lights, what I say is supposed to be indicator, indicator, underscore, LF, and R. Uh, let's see, one, let's see, uh, this is the left side, so we'll do, uh, can I not spell, underscore, LF. Indicator underscore LL and I'm gonna copy this. My eyes burning and I'm gonna change this to RL because it's my right side. Yep, god damn it. Yep, right side. <laughs> highlight the thing. I'm gonna highlight them together because I, I, I can do like that. I highlight that. Go by material. Find my damn lights. Then them bitches go. Uh, we're gonna do the left side first. Pop over the properties. It's name zero. We're gonna call that thing five, Bobby. Boom. Vertex, same thing. Five, Bobby. Yeah, loud. We're gonna pop back over here. Come back over here to uh, select by material. My lights. Unhighlight it. And this gonna be six. Six. Boom. Vertex. Six. Boom. Yes, loud. Oh, damn. I don't be on highlight now. I don't highlight the public part though. Boom. Now we got that together. I'm gonna isolate structure. Isolate this one because it's not converted to compound. There we go. Now we got indicators. And I think I want to do one more thing because now I don't have no front daytime running lights since I just gave this shit signals. Uh, we'll probably give it some daytime running lights. Let's see how the let me see how the front of this shit made. I'm gonna show y'all how to turn parts into that. Uh, oh, I'm gonna be ignorant. I'm gonna turn the this little rectangle to watch this, y'all. Watch me do something ignorant. <laughs> yeah, loud user. All right, let me see how this shit highlight first. 
Cause I might can't be that ignorant. Ugh, disgusting. 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 This shit highlights horribly. We'll turn this into one then. Let me see how I highlight. I'm gonna do element select. Uh did you been did you been eating it? To be honest. Uh let me go up here first. We're gonna go material browser, turn it on. And it's lights. I use I like all my lights to be at the top. That way I don't care what fall at the bottom. So I'm gonna double click my default material and then I'm gonna hit copy. It drop a new material up on the nail. I'm gonna call that thing LED just for the hell of it. You can name whatever you want to, but make sure you double click it afterwards so it uh, assign to that. Hit that Pac Man in the gills. Come down here to GTA Vehicle Generics and you wanna hit Lighter Miss Silk. And only thing that gets missing is a detail. You can put whatever text you want right there, uh, but. I'm just going to put this on here because I just want to light up. You could grab you something like this if you wanted to. Like if you wanted your lights to light up with that on it or one of those on it. Uh, you just have to UV map it. But I, don't, I ain't going to do all that. I'm just going to do this because I'm going I'm to turn it back. I ain't going to leave a shit like that. Alright, I got my new material made. I'm just going to push this to the side. I went, I did element because this ain't attached to nothing else but itself, so it should highlight nothing but this. When you, when they, when the pilots and shit be connected and you use element, it'll select everything it's connected to. But this shouldn't be like that, so, yep. And to confirm, I'm gonna hit H on the computer, uh, keyboard, hide it, that's the only thing that's done. I'm just gonna hit backspace. Alright, and that bit danger black. Let me grab the LED light. Ah. Uh, and I wanted to, I want to be able to change it to whatever color I wanted to be. Since it's a daytime running light, uh, dang, can I click behind this space? The brackets, all capital letters, paint, uh, the semicolon, and let me pick a number. Mm, we'll do, uh, we'll just do paint two for now. We ain't leaving that on now. Alright. We're going to drop this over the danger black. Boom. Now that's our daytime running light, Bobby. I'm going to unhighlight it, get up out of that material browser. And then go to properties, backspace one time. And make sure it's set to zero. Even in vertex. Yep. Alright. We good. Show all. So now that's gonna be my daytime run. <laughs> that's gonna be my daytime running light, y'all. Yeah, it's loud. I'm gonna show y'all what it look like in game real quick. Make sure my signals and shit work. Make sure my high beams, all that, whatever. Export it. Uh, then open IV and replace them things. Mm-mm-mm-mm. Mm -mm. And at the snap of finger Bobby. I see y'all in the game. Yellow. Back in the thing, man. Alright, let's see what we got going on. Okay, our side lights and on. Oh, oh, we got our daytime running light. We just gotta change the color of that bit red. I can turn it off and it go off. Come on. Boom, oh, that bitch a daytime running light, Bobby. Uh, let's see, colors. And we'll just make it some light so it's fucking be brighter. Uh, silver? Yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, loud, that bitch lit up now, Bobby. All right, let's see about our lights, Bobby. All right, they both coming on, though. Hold on, it might be dark enough. I want y'all to see it separate. Oh, yep, there you go. All right. Yeah, law. So we got the daytime running lights, our headlight. Throw some high beams on. Let's change the, uh, let's do our signal. Yeah, law. Right. Left, right. Let me see you do it. Left, do it. Right, do it. Hey, we in this bitch. Yeah, law. We in there like booty hell. 
Yeah, law. If y'all be liking the content, Bobby, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Bobby, comment down below for anything you want to see or hear from your boy. Spade, man. A, man. Save, man. We finna go get crazy in this big body, Bobby. Yeah, law. Oh, we hit a Lambo. Oh, fuck. We hit a goddamn Lambo. Oh, man. Niggas is texting us. This bitch is running to me. We finna kill y'all. All right, y'all. Y'all stay safe and dangerous, Bobby. Yes, law.